going on, guys? Drones of Dogs here. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> All right, guys, this is another breezy day today here. We are here with the little micro guy, the little tiny guy, the little the little baby Mavic Air. If the Mavic Air had a baby, this would be the thing that it birthed right here. <laughs> this is the Ishin E61 W, guys. What does W stand for? W stands for Wi-Fi. We finna fly this little joker here today. Now, you've seen this guy on the channel before. Ooh, my phone fell out my mouth. You've seen this guy on the channel before. I did the indoor flight with it. I did a initial review with it. And we just finna take this guy out for a quick fly. You guys, you've been, you've been fiending for the drone videos. And I told you guys I was gonna be hitting you guys with the bangers. And that's what we're gonna do. Keep hitting you guys with the bangers. So let me connect to this Wi-Fi real quick. Connect to this Wi-Fi. We should be good to go. We are connected to the Wi-Fi. Uh, this Ishin E61. Um, let me get to the app. And we're going to get this review busting, you guys. We're going to get it busting. For the one time, for the one time. You already know how we rock. So, all right. Let's go ahead and just... All right, I got FPV feed. So, let's go ahead and start the recording. Recording has started, you guys. I'm going to go to the high rate. And we are going to take off with this little joker. The little baby... Mavic Air. <laughs> Alright, the wind settled down just a little bit. Seems like I need some trim. Give a little forward trim there. So we are in the high rate, you guys. Because this thing is tiny. It's a tiny little thing. It's tiny. High rate with the Ishin E61 W. You guys, check that bad boy out. So the camera is angled down pretty much a lot. So you gotta pretty much fly high to even see anything. And we don't wanna fly too high with this little guy because the higher you go guys, the more winds you're dealing with. We all know that. There's a flip for that little guy. Flip was kind of wonky there a little bit. Let's try another one. All right, that was a little better. So what's good about this little guy here? Well, number one, it's flying good. It flies great. Number two, it's cheap, dirt cheap. This thing was like less than 20 bucks, you guys. And you can get a different, you can get a couple different battery options. So that's, that's, a, that's another good thing. It has options where you can get a single battery version like I did here, or you can get two battery, three batteries. It comes in different colors. I got black, you can get blue, you can get red. And for a dirt cheap little Wi-Fi FPV flyer, guys, the fly is really good. And if you are a beginner, you can learn to fly a drone for dirt cheap. Less than 20 bucks, you can learn to fly a drone, guys. This thing operates and flies just like a big drone would fly. The same uh, controls are th that of a big drone, like a Mavic or something like that. The controls are exactly the same. The only thing this thing doesn't do that the big drone has is a GPS. It doesn't have GPS or optical flow or nothing like that. But other than that, the controls are just the same. And this thing is tiny. So the good thing about having a little tiny drone like this is that you can fly indoors, you can fly outdoors, of course, as you can see right now. And um, it gives you a chance to learn and be able to get more flights in with a little guy like this. Because if it's too windy outside, you can still learn and practice indoors in a more confined space and that's going to make you a lot better pilot you guys trust me trust me a lot of my first flying when i first started out was indoors <laughs> you know and i always recommend for new pilots or you know newbies to fly indoors anyways because what's the first mistake that a newbie does is they take the drone out too far or too high and that thing flies away on them so at least when you're indoors, you can't, you ain't gonna worry about the drone flying away. The worst thing you can do is crash into a wall. <laughs> at least you still have your drone. So this thing is flying pretty good, man. Pretty good on a single battery. Single battery, look at that. 
pretty good. We got over three and a half minutes of recording, three, three and a half minutes, 45 seconds. So we're approaching four minutes of recording, you guys, and this thing is flying like a little dream. But such a little tiny battery, it has a pretty decent flight time. That's another thing I was impressed with this guy, is the little flight time on that little battery. It's a tiny little battery. The drone itself is tiny. The controller is bigger than the drone. Kind of pan it around. Yeah, this is a real good flyer, you guys. Real good. All right, we got about almost about four and a half minutes of recording. I'm gonna stop the recording. Recording stop. Let's just bring this guy in and just finish flying this battery out. Give you guys a close look at this bad boy. I just wanted to pop out for another quick flight for you guys. And I'll just show you guys how this thing flies. As, a, as it's the quadcopter itself, it flies real good. Oh, it's getting a little sluggish. I think that's our flight time. Bow! That's our flight time. Awesome flyer, guys. This is the Ishin E61W, guys. Uh, I believe they have this camera version, and I think they got a non-camera version. I'm not too sure. Either way, guys, you can't go wrong. I will drop a link for this guy below if you guys are interested in picking one up. Nice little cheap flyer, guys. Anything, if you don't pick this one up, just check out my channel, guys. I got plenty of drones for you to check out. RC cars. The point is, just get out and enjoy the hobby, and I hope you guys do. I'm your boy, Drones and Dogs. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Catch you guys in the next episode. I am out. Deuces.